When setting up a chromatography analysis you often have to follow guidelines, like a standard operating procedure SOP. There are many areas where manual sequence creation can cause errors. E-workflow procedures provide a template to create a complete, correct sequence with predefined files and a well-defined structure. E-workflow procedures minimize the amount of training required and take you from samples to reliable results in a minimum number of steps. Let's look at an example of using an e-workflow procedure. In the e-workflows category, select your e-workflow procedure, select an available instrument, and go. Select the number of samples, and the position of the first injection. You can start the sequence immediately. Both rack layout and sequence preview are automatically updated. And the sequence can be edited, for example for sample names and injection position. When ready, click finish. And the sequence is created and started. To view the running instrument, click the button. And the e-panel opens. What about running two channels at the same time? Like front and back of a GC. The e-workflow procedure can be launched from the instrument view. And includes the linked instrument. So when the samples are added, the sequence preview shows the instrument name and the correct instrument method is assigned, and the injection position is separated on the sample. Sequences with the same name automatically number incrementally and are created in the prescribed directory. A great example of fast, accurate sequence creation using e-workflow procedures.